Today on 21st Century Business, explore state-of-the-art technology, innovative business strategies, insights from cutting-edge corporations around the globe, a visionary look into the answers of tomorrow today. Business leaders, business solutions, 21st Century Business. Welcome to 21st Century Business, I'm Jackie Bales. These days, consumers are pretty tough customers. Not only are they holding on tightly to their wallets, but they expect retailers to provide value and relevancy everywhere, online, mobile, and in their community. Seems that having the product and location is only half the battle these days. Here to explain how small to medium-sized retailers can successfully compete with the Amazons of the retail world is Shemaine Das, CEO and founder of Unite U Technologies. Thanks for joining us, Shemaine. Hi, Jackie. Yes, it's extremely challenging for uh, the smaller retailers to actually compete. Um, the, the bigger retailers, uh, Amazon, etc., have set customer expectations so high. And um, as far as you know, be able to actually uh, go to a retailer that provides value. And I, I think part of the question is what's the value? Mm -hmm. um, each of these smaller retailers, you know, be, uh, and retail for a reason. Uh, they, they have a strategy or they should have a strategy of how to actually engage customers. Before it used to be just have the location and the product. Now it's a whole, you know, this whole different ball game in actually creating a relationship with your customer and keeping them. So you're really empowering these retailers then. Yeah. Tell us who Unite U is and how you got started. Okay, so Unite U started about 10 years ago, um, just when um, the internet was actually going to be um, the death knell of, uh, of, of bricks and mortar retailing as we well, have, and, 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 and malls were going to be ghost towns. And look how we've evolved. Um, the truth of the matter is, is the internet has actually helped integrate and bind people together. So you offer a platform on which they can do what? Yes, we, we created a platform, I think we're in fifth generation now, that uh, really um, targets the, the retailers who don't have the technical expertise or don't want the technical expertise to be in-house because uh, much rather than, they, they'd much rather spend their money uh, on good marketing and sales and merchandising uh, people um, and expertise to actually help you know, implement uh, programs that reach not, uh, not only you know, in the store or on the website, but now with the big mobile uh, push, uh, you know, internet, interconnected to the mobile devices, into Facebook, um, shopping engines. It's, it's, endless. A little, it's, a, it's an endless, <laughs> it's an endless challenge. And, and really, you know, we've become a, a technology partner with them to really let them uh, implement their vision um, without having to actually deal with a lot of the, t the technical issues. Um, you know, what we found is that retailers have a great vision, but they really don't know how to use the technology in the right way. Well, to see just one example of how Unite You turn things around, let's go to this 21st century business field report. So when we set out to find a vendor uh, to help us with the technology side, we needed to find one that understood the retail space and could also uh, allow us to not only sell online, but allow us to put our information online and connect the two. And that's what we found with Unite You. Smart retailers continue to grow. They do so by embracing the complete marriage of their physical presence as well as their participation in the virtual communities. Well, it was really important to us that when we translated the store to the online space that we kept the connection to our customers. So when we went to the online space where we did, obviously wouldn't have practitioners live, we wanted to make sure that we still had a way to connect to them. With Unite U, we were able to load not only our product selection into the system, but also a lot of information about health and wellness. Uh, if you're looking at a particular article about a health and wellness topic, uh, the related products are, are there as well. So it kind of maintains that balance between product, uh, selling products and, um, and information online. For 21st Century Business, I'm Corey Brand reporting. Well, it's always nice, Shemaine, hearing about the ways that the smaller businesses can take on the big boys and try to level that playing field. So thank you so much for sharing your insight with us. Well, thank you, Jack, for having me. And thank you for watching. For 21st Century Business, I'm Jackie Bales.